and welcome to Euclidean Geometry Idol. And now for our first contestant. Hello. Hi. What's your name, sweetie? Penelope Point. Wow, that's a beautiful name. What will you be singing for us? I'll be singing an original song called Pointing at You. Go ahead. A point has no dimension and is usually represented by a dot. Well, it's okay. Even if I lose, there's always next year, right? Okay. The results are in. You are moving on in the competition. Well, that was awkward. Now let's move on to the next contestant. Hi. Hello. What's your name, hon? Lacey Line. Wow, that's a great name. What will you be singing for us? I'll be singing a song called Lying on You by yours truly, moi. Well then, why don't you begin? A line extends into one dimension. It usually is represented by a straight line. Into two arrowheads to indicate that the line extends without end in two directions. You need at least two points to make a line. And we are back with the results. So how are you feeling? I already won. <laughs> oh, well, okay. Let's check the results. Oh, um, I don't know how to tell you this, but you're not really moving on to the next round. Are you serious? It's what the judges have said. I can't really do anything about it. They're just jealous of my talent. Whatever makes you feel better, huh? Now let's move on to the next contestant. Hello. What's your name? Patty Plain. Wow, that's a nice name. What will you be singing for us? I'll be singing just plain. Begin. A plane extends in two dimensions. It is usually represented by a shape that looks like a tabletop or a wall. You must imagine that a plane extends without an end Even though the drawing of a plane appears to have edges And the results are in You are moving on to the competition, congrats! <laughs> to the next contestant. But I don't want to be here. Um, hello. Hi. Uh, what's your name? Abby the Angle Measure. Wow, that's a very interesting name. What will you be singing for us? I'll be singing an original song called In Between the Angles. Please begin. An angle measure is the number of degrees in an an angle is a figure formed by two rays or a segment sharing a common endpoint called a vertex. An angle measure is greater than zero degrees, but it's less than 180 degrees. If the angle measure is 180 degrees, it will no longer be an angle, it will be a line. And still, there's another bunch of boats to be unfolded, so how are you feeling before we tell you what, what you got? I still don't want to be here. Okay. Um, and I feel like because of that, you're not making it to the next round. Yes! Guess some don't want to be here, guys. Now, let's move on to the next contestant. Hello? Hi. What's your name? Lynn. Wow, that's a nice name. What will we be singing for us? I'll be singing a song called Moving On to the Next Line. Please begin. Mm. 
an intersection of two lines is the single point at which the two lines meet or cross each other. And the results are in. I'm sorry, but you're not moving on in the competition. Well, um, uh, yeah, let's just move on to the next contestant. Hello there. Hi. Well, what's your name? Peggy Perpendicular. That's a wonderful name. So what will you be singing for us today? Perpendicular for life. Wow, okay, well, why don't you begin? Two lines are called perpendicular lines if they intersect to form a right angle. But not only lines have to be perpendicular, Planes can also be perpendicular to each other, and a plane and a point can be perpendicular to each other! And we are in with the results. So how are you feeling about your performance, Peggy? Great, great. I think I did really good. Good? Okay, well let's find out how you did. And it looks like the odds were not so much in your favor. Good luck next year, but this time you're not going on to the next round. It's okay. May peace be with you. Well, thanks. See you sometime soon, too. Now, let's move on to the next contestant. Hello. Hi. What's your name? Payson Parallel. Wow, cute name. So, what do you sing for us? Parallel Power. Ooh, cute. Okay, we'll begin. Two lines are parallel if they are coplanar and do not intersect. Not only are lines parallel, planes can also be parallel as well. Okay, well we have the results with us. And by golly, you're moving on to the next round. Yes, yes, thank you so much. You are welcome.